This is our bacteria overview figure, and in this video we'll be discussing Shigella, which you can see right here. This scene will take place just off of Main Street with a bunch of horses in a parade. If you've ever been to a parade, you probably know that the horses usually poop all over the street. So notice that we've shown a bunch of poop all over the sidewalk from these horses. I guess you could call this poop shit, depending on how vulgar you're feeling. And right now, to help you remember this image, we'll refer to this as shit because shit sounds like Shigella. Just like in our other gram negative videos, notice that we've made the sunset red appearing. And this is to help you remember that Shigella is gram negative. This is a gram stain of Shigella. Notice that it's pink or red appearing under the microscope and is rod shaped, which is why it's classified as a gram negative bacillus. Most parades have a pooper scooper team that walks alongside the horses and cleans up all of the poop. So we've shown a team of three cleaning up the mess. And just like with our Salmonella video, these three guys working together to clean up the mess should help you remember that Shigella utilizes a type three secretion system. They're supposed to clean up the mess by placing it inside of the garbage. However, some of these guys are goofing off and thought it would be funny to intentionally splatter poop all over the guy towards the top of the image. Look at that poop all over his shoulder. That's pretty nasty. Anyway, this part of the scene is depicting one human transmitting the poop to another human which should help you remember that Shigella exhibits human-to-human -human transmission only. In other words, it's not transmitted through animals, unlike Salmonella enterica. Also notice that we've included several raspberry patches towards the front of the image. Just like in our Salmonella video, these are here to help you remember that Shigella invades the gastrointestinal tract through M cells, which are found in Pyre's patches. We showed this in our Salmonella video, but recall that this is an image of Pyre's patches seen from a cross-section of the ileum. The highlighted red circle right here is a Pyre's patch. So Shigella goes from the lumen over here into the intestinal tissue by gaining access through M cells like this. Okay, with this in mind, let's return to the image. 